Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to solve linear equations using a general strategy. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. The example we have here is this. 2 thirds times 3m minus 6 equals m minus 5, and we want to solve this linear equation. Now, when you see many different linear equations to solve for the variable, they're all going to be mostly different. But we can follow this general strategy here to try to simplify or solve for m. So what I'm going to do first here is I'm going to distribute this 2 thirds into this parenthesis here. There's nothing that I see that I can simplify right away, so I'm going to do that. I want to multiply the 2 thirds to both parts. 2 thirds times a 3m, the 3's cancel, and we're left with just a 2m. Minus 2 thirds times a 6, right there. The 3 and the 6 kind of cancel out, leaving a 2 up top, and 2 times, or here, I'll just write it out here, 2 thirds times 6, so it's a little easier to see. And bring down the 5 minus the m. Then from here, well, the 2 thirds, like I said, and the 6 kind of cancel, and we have a 2 up here. So we have a 2m now minus 2 times 2, which is a 4. And then 5 minus the m. Now we want to combine our like terms. So what I'm going to do is bring my m values to the left and my normal numbers to the right. I add an m here to both sides. And I'm going to add a 4 to both sides as well. These m's will cancel and these 4's cancel. 2m plus a 1m is a 3m, and 5 plus 4 is 9. From there, we divide 3 to both sides, opposite of multiplication is division, 3's cancel, and m equals, well, 9 divided by 3, which is 3. Now, one thing it's important to do is to check our work. Make sure we did this right. We got m equals 3, but we want to see, was it actually correct? So what we're going to do is rewrite our original equation and substitute 3 in for m, just to be sure. So we take 2 thirds, and we have 3 times our m value, and I'm going to put 3, that's what we found. Minus 6 is equal to 5 minus, and again instead of m, I'm putting that 3. From there we want to simplify or solve, we're, <laughs> we're not really solving, sorry, simplifying. Keeping the left and right hand side separate with the equal sign and seeing if they're equal. So again, 2 thirds, we're going to keep on the outside, 3 times 3 is a 9, minus 6. We're following our order of operations here. 5 minus 3 is a good old 2, we can do that. 2 thirds still on the outside, 9 minus 6 is also a 3, and we still have a 2 on the right. 2 thirds times a 3, the 3's cancel, and we're left with just a 2. And we see 2 is equal to 2, meaning that 3 was a solution to our equation, so our check worked out. So again, 3 is our final answer here. I hope you learned how to solve linear equations using a general strategy. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So, as always, thanks for watching.